Orange Grand Bonanza 367 Hotel Papa with Sierra looking for an IFR to Columbia County. Flying about 5,000 miles this week. Uh, tonight we're just going to Rochester, New York. Gonna stop in Columbia County for some cheap fuel. Then on to South Dakota tomorrow. Uh, another stop in South Dakota on Wednesday. Thursday we're heading down to Sun and Fun. And then Friday after Sun and Fun we're heading to the Bahamas for a couple days. So it's gonna be an action-packed adventure here. Potential aircraft, uh, wind shear alert, uh, 2 zero knot, gain for a runway, a 2-2 two arrival with a runway. Yeah, this has been pretty interesting. Uh, they're super busy for 11 p.m. And uh, the wind, or the weather's just been crazy. Wind switching directions, so we've had to switch. Uh, and they're just shuffling everybody around. And right now, the surface winds are 130 at 7 knots, and here, 1,500 feet in the air, the winds are 145 at 50. Yeah. There's a 367 Hotel Papa, Rochester Tower, wind 260 at 26, gust 44, runway 25, clear for takeoff. 25, clear for takeoff, belt tight? Always. Bonanza 7, Hotel Papa, contact departure. 7, Hotel Papa, we're departing. Good evening. So yeah, it's not too bumpy up here, but the wind's still, still got a 53 knot headwind right now, so we're only going 60 knots over the ground as we climb. So we had a little bit of weather here just around Rochester that was making the wind pretty crazy. Rochester approach, runway 304 is 44 knots as we took off. Over in South Dakota, there's just a little bit, but I don't think that's going to turn into much. So, the wind that we took off, the weather's terrific for flying today. Beautiful views out here. So, yeah, let's take out a step. Now that we're all set up here in cruise, got some good snacks, great day to go flying. Uh, just want to explain a little bit about what we're actually doing this week. And uh, also I get a lot of questions about why I have a plane, how I afford to go flying. So first, for those of you who don't know, a few years ago, in 2014, I flew this plane around the world, set the world record as the youngest person to fly solo around the world. So that's sort of how I ended up with the plane in the first place. Um, I'm, I currently leased the plane, that's how I started it. Uh, basically, I came across this idea to go fly solo around the world, and I needed a plane to use. So I needed to find someone who would lease me a plane. And so that was a pretty tough sell to find somebody that was actually willing to lease a 19-year-old with 500 hours a uh, plane to go fly solo around the world. Uh, I finally found this guy out in San Diego. That's where I got the plane. For the trip, I raised money. I uh, had a no bunch of different sponsors, so that's how I paid for the trip. Since then, I've been doing a lot of speaking engagements, and so I go around talking to different businesses and groups and whatever, telling the story of, of how I flew around the world and kind of all of the uh, you know, business and life challenges involved in, in doing something like flying around the world. So there's enough that I'm able to do because I have the Bonanza that it covers a huge portion of the actual fixed costs of continuing to have the Bonanza. A lot of my trips uh, you know, end up traveling somewhere with friends, so we split the cost, so it you just generally keeps the, the cost pretty low. There's a lot of different ways that you can make flying very affordable, uh, particularly if you already travel a lot. So, you know, if you travel a lot, you know, you can probably save some money and just have a lot more fun flying yourself in your own plane. But, you know, if you need to travel a lot for business, you can also save money, save a lot of time, be able to, you know, do more, which is essentially what I'm doing. You know, I'm able to do more speaking engagements to the point where it pays for, you know, the cost of the plane. That's essentially how I, I make this affordable, and uh, so I hope that makes sense. If you guys have any questions, you know, hit up in the comments below.
I think I like Triscuits a lot more than I thought I liked Triscuits. Yeah? Yeah. I like how salty they are. Yeah. So a little bit about what we're actually doing this week. Last night, I started in Boston, stopped in Columbia County, New York, uh, Hudson, New York, I guess, to uh, get some cheap gas. Met a guy, uh, Chris, who had who came out and you know, said hi to me, helped me fuel the plane up, uh, showed me his new travel air that he just got. One of the great things about aviation is just how friendly uh, the whole aviation community is. Center 367, Hotel Papa, to center maintain 2,300, report uh, Niles in sight, 12 o'clock, 1 zero miles. 2,300, Papa. Now, today we're flying from Rochester to, I don't actually know where we're going right now. Right now we're going to uh, Niles, Michigan, uh, to get some, some more cheap gas. And then we're continuing on to Rapid City, South Dakota. I got to speak there a couple times tomorrow. Uh, then we're flying home to Aberdeen. We're going to sort of like spend the overnight there. Then Thursday, we might meet up with another friend. Then we're going to fly down to uh, Lincoln, Nebraska to meet some other friends, uh, just to see them for a little bit. And then we're going to fly down to probably somewhere around Memphis to get gas. And we're going to fly to Bartow, uh, just down just next to Lakeland, Florida. Go check out Sun and Fun Friday morning, speak there, just to take in the show for a little bit. Then we're going to fly down to uh, Somewhere in the Palm Beach area, we're going to meet up a couple other friends, a couple of pilot buddies down there. They're flying down on JetBlue. Then the four of us are going to go fly around the Bahamas for a couple days, and then uh, fly back to you know, essentially to Rochester and then Boston. And this stuff is really just made possible by the fact that a plane is just an incredible business tool, and uh, so, you, know, you can use it in so many different ways. You know, really just adding like fun and fun in the Bahamas stuff is only a, a few hundred dollars because. That's all the extra it is compared to just flying from Boston to uh, South Dakota and back, like I would have had to for the speaking engagement. And I see now we're kind of in and out of the clouds, and the air temperature is zero Celsius. And a minute ago it was negative one, so I'll have to keep an eye out for icing and maybe go just a little bit lower today.
Uh, and if you just start to take on all of those challenges every time that you come to one, you start to develop this habit of just not accepting that something can be too hard. So I just finished a fun day of speaking. I spoke at this Day of Excellence event. Uh, there were like 1,400 people, just a ton of energy. It was really fun. Some other great speakers, uh, including Judson Lapley, the creator of the evolution of dance. So that was pretty cool. Got to see that live in person. Uh, just stuff like that. Now we're heading home to Aberdeen for a, the night. And then tomorrow we're heading to Sun and Fun. Ellsworth departure Bonanza 367 Hotel Papa 3900 climbing 9000. Number 367 Hotel Papa Ellsworth departure radar contact. at Hangar 9 here in Aberdeen, best FBO in the world, and now we're here with Southern Hey Matt, you copy? Yeah. Hey, this is your cousin Ryan. I'm number two behind you in the Mooney. Oh, hey, how's it going? Good, man. I didn't even know you are in town. Yeah, I just stopped for the night. I'm heading down to Sun and Fun today and then the Bahamas for a couple days and then back to Boston. Man, I need to go with you. <laughs> Where are you up to? <laughs> heading up North Dakota to get our air tractors ready for the season. Nice. Aberdeen traffic, man. The 7 Hotel Pop is departing runway uh, 13, Aberdeen. Okay, when you shut your buckle and buckle, that's shut. Aberdeen traffic, many of the seven hotel bombs is off of one three departing straight out, Aberdeen. Use caution for parallel runway misalignment. If not familiar, advise. Seven hotel Papa. Hotel Papa, keep your turn to final inside of four miles. Clear for your perch on a three five. Keep the turn inside four miles. Clear to visual three five. Seven hotel Papa. Seven hotel Papa, thanks for your help. Contact tower one one eight point five. Tower eighteen five seven five good day. Lincoln Tower, the end of the three six seven hotel Papa, visual three five. Hands at 367 Hotel Papa Lincoln Tower, good afternoon, runway 35, clear to land, wind 34010, goes to 16, traffic, citation, mile final. 35, clear to land, traffic, 75. 2 ground, 0 point one. Hands at 7 Hotel Papa, citation, traffic, no factor. Okay, gears down, get the green, green, pops. 
forward enough in the moment to turn the final here, bleeding off from airspeed, and we should be just right on. And the 7 Hotel Papa, make the right turn at Kilo Ground Point Niner, we'll see you. Right, Kilo Ground Point Nine, 7 Hotel Papa, see you. Gravity in the 367 Hotel Papa, Kilo, going to Silverhawk. 367 Hotel Papa, Lincoln Ground, taxi with actually Kilo Strand. Kilo, 7 Hotel Papa. So, one of the great things about flying yourself uh, wherever you're going is that you can stop anywhere along the way, like nothing is really out of the way. So we're just dropping into Lincoln, Nebraska for a minute, that's way too far back, uh, <laughs> to see a couple friends from high school, grab some ice cream or something with them, and then we'll get back in the air, head down to Sun and Fun. On longer flights like this, there's not a whole lot to do other than just sit back, relax, drink some coke and stay awake, keep an eye on the traffic, weather, and hopefully get the uh, latest vlog out. Top of 2459, I think we're in Missouri right now. Memphis, Thunder Bonanza 367, Hotel Papa 11000. Bonanza 367, Hotel Papa, Memphis, Center Roger. What plane's activity 3012? 3012. Now we're getting to the south. 45 minutes out from Memphis. Suppose it would be appropriate to drink some Elvis. <laughs> Hotel Papa, runway 22, clear to land, winds 2905. 22, clear to land, 7 Hotel yeah. Papa, contact Mr. Departure, 124.15, thanks for coming by, we'll see it. Over to Departure, thanks for the help, 7 Hotel Papa, good night. Attention all craft hazards, weather information, Air Met 4, Louisiana, Mississippi, Alabama, Kentucky, Tennessee, West Virginia, Virginia, North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia, Florida, and the coast waters, Elvin High West Flight Service, Virginia. 7 Hotel Papa, contact Jacksonville Center on 135.8. If no joy on that frequency, we attend Jacksonville on 134.3. Okay, 134.3. 
Alpha, try 135.8 or 134.3, something like that. Can I go? Five minutes to find the sportiest tent, get set up, and be ready to ski. We might make it. There's a lot to be said about having a plan, flying a plan, but you also just have to be ready to completely throw the plan out the window. Strawberry shortcake or is it all one thing? No, we have, well, the strawberry shortcake gets a dip of ice cream. 